The Void Elf Allied Race is a new playable race unlocked in Battle for Azeroth. To unlock Void Elf Allied Race, you must first have Battle for Azeroth expansion installed. You'll also need to complete the Void Elf unlock requirements. Now, this does involve a special recruitment quest and the tracking achievement for Allied Race Void Elf unlock requirements are marked as account wide. You are now prepared. Requires a completion of the Argus storyline, which should take several hours to complete. And Exalted for the Argusian Reach may take several weeks to obtain, as you can only earn limited amount of reputation through World and Emissary quests. However, in 8.1, World Quests award twice as much reputation. Now, you'll have to also go ahead and complete the special recruitment quest line, which demonstrates why the Void Elves have decided to join the Alliance rather than the Horde. The Void Elf recruitment scenario requires you to complete a short quest line available after you've purchased Battle for Azeroth and completed the achievements and reputation requirements. Now you can go ahead and pick this up in the Stormwind Embassy. The faction mount for the Void Elf is the Star Cursed Void Strider and it can be used by any Alliance race. The mount is unlocked when you complete the Allied Race Void Elf creation for the first time. Available classes are Hunter, starting out with a Void Stalker as a pet, Mage, Monk, Priest, Rogue, Warlock, Warrior, and the racials for the Void Elf are Spatel Rift, Tear a Rift in Space, and Reactivate this ability to teleport through the Rift. Now this does have a 3 minute cooldown. We also have a few racial passives such as Chill of the Night, reducing the shadow damage taken by 1%. Entropic Embrace, your abilities have a change to empower you with the Essence of the Void. And the Entropic Embrace will also increase damage and healing by 5% for 12 seconds. It has a 33% proc change with a 60 second internal cooldown. Ethereal Connection. Reduces the cost of the void storage and transmogrification by 50%. Now this is awesome. It's going to save a lot of people some serious gold. Paternal Nature Calm. Spell cased are not delayed by taking damage. Now for reaching 110 with a void elf allied race without a leveling boost, you'll receive the Heritage of the Void, Feet of Strength, and a Rendora set, a highly detailed cosmetic armor set that looks very cool. Now you can only transmog this with other Void Elves. There's also a matching tabard. Rendora tabard is awarded to you after you've created your first Void Elf. You log in and turn in the first quest called Forby Alliance. Now in a game filled with Elves, do you plan to play a Void Elf? Let me know in the comments section below. Be sure to subscribe, give a thumbs up, and tell all your friends. Until next time, I'll see you in Ezra.